Hi, good to be with you again. You know, every time I start, I have to think what the devil I want to do beside I would like to teach. See, now, how the devil I get it right? Um, there are so many paintings painted. There are so many. I brought so many artists on TV already, and everyone paints other landscape, other seascape. My big dream is right now to be the greatest teacher ever lived. So in order for you to go on painting, I don't care about the subject anymore. I just would like to, as a sample, I will paint fog. How about that? Just say fog. Don't matter where I am. I paint fog. See, that's it. Paint wind. Paint movements. See, we always paint it. Beautiful tree, a beautiful mountain, a beautiful cliff. But, you know, we want to learn to paint. So let's paint fog. Don't be mad of me if it turn, turn out too good, but it will be fog. <laughs> I will mess up the whole canvas. Okay, the magic light is on. You see, the magic light is on. That means the canvas is wet. The canvas is wet. You see, there. So... Now, on the wet canvas with the white, I just put colors in. Now, what kind of a fog? Sometimes you see such a clean, clean fog, like crisp. Then you see a dirty fog. Then I see a fog that is just hanging. Other fog is moving. You see, fog is not so easy because uh, there are different types of movements I want to put in. White is on the canvas. I will get black. Use a bit of black, a bit of Prussian blue, see, a bit of Prussian blue, a bit of alizarin crimson. Those three colors are just wonderful. But I think I will put a bit of red into that this time. I would like to have a bit of red. But you see, but what I mix here, it looks so nothing. It is nothing because it's the bare color. See, they are so dark because mixing on the canvas is where, where the colors come out. Before we was mixing on the palette, and it takes you a whole year to finish your painting. Now, this is what I developed one day because I learned by uh, painting like that. It took me too long. And I learned this, all the colors need white. All those colors need white. No matter what you do, they need white. So I had a brainstorm one day, and I said, all right, then, then uh, why not put that white right on the canvas? And then I mix right on that canvas. See, now, I'm not so dumb. <laughs> there you are. See, now watch. See, that lo look at that brush, it looks so dark. But there's white on the canvas. Now I will, I want to paint fog. See, this is already fog. Now, depends on how you attach it. See, if I attach it like that, then I ruin the whole thing. Be like a pussycat. Start off with with fog, and you see the movement, you see the power out of your brush, and you see wherever you want to have fog, and how it moves, and how it rolls around, and how it disappears, and how it comes up again, and how it, uh, see? Can you see now? It's a very gentle movement. That is the secret. If you can do that, then there's no problem. You know, I still, Create this fog, this fog, whatever, a kind of a certain color, and then I stick to that color. It has a bit of red in, it has it's a nice, nice fog, I would say. It's kind of a nice fog. It is not too hard on you. But then, if you make it all even, it's not good either. The, you should have holes in, the, there's little holes, they should be there. Don't make it too solid. Then, then there's not fog anymore. Then there's a color. Then you make you can paint your name on it, and that's the end of it. See, the the fog comes out when you see there you are. And and when you paint fog, whisper. <laughs> let it run by, or let it come forward. Or oh, I remember my fishing days on on freshwater lakes. I fished early in the morning, and the early morning the fog is rising off the water, and you hear the birds, and you, you see sometimes just a deer head sticking out, or you see sometimes just the roof of a house sticking out, and a couple trees, you, you never see the whole thing. 
And then as you come in there and you see the whole thing. So three, three, sing along with Mitch. Try to sing along with, see, I think about all those things right now, and then, and then I roll it, I will, the fog, they, they say fog is rolling in, fog is rolling out. See, already the name, it's rolling, it's rolling out. But something is blown in, it's blown out. <clears throat> That's whatever you want. You can have it really in shifts line there and you, you blow it in. But in this case, I would like to roll it in. Can you see? It's beautiful here. See? And I roll my fog on and on. See? The next step, I can go on all the time. So let's just see how we go on from there. See? This fog. Right now it's this fog. This beautiful fog. Can you see how light I touch? What? I will show you how I do wrong. Now, see, what the brush has still in the inside? I didn't use it. I just push the cat around. Fog, 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 fog. I want fog, and it was fog. See, a big dream. See, now, in that fog, all of a sudden, you can, I use the one inch brush. I would say there are trees far away. And I would use the same colors, same four colors first. And nothing else, I just press a bit harder. There is some kind of whatever standing there. Whatever standing there, I don't know. Is a tree, is a tree. See, it's already too, too hard. It's too hard. See, make it just whisper, whisper. Something standing there. Something standing there. Something is standing there. Something is standing there. See? Something is standing. And then you can create kind of a line. You can act like there's a, there's a whole line of trees standing there. See, then you know roughly, oh, that's the beginning of the forest there, far away. Beginning of the forest. Uh, but we just fog. Think the, the, the top is for it is a bit darker and it gets lighter, lighter as you come on. Hey, there you are. Hey, that's in the fog. Now, then you can reverse. See, use a big fan brush. Use your big fan brush now. Then you can use white. And I bring the white back as a sample. The, think about the light is always from the top, usually. See what I do here? See? See, always on there. But then when you do it like that, then then there got to be dark underneath. That's no why you can't do it different. It has to be dark underneath. See, there is a bit more darker. Then, then you get that fog together. It's like a cloud. You start to get a cloud together. See there. Let it be light on top and, and darker there. And all of a sudden, you, you roll the cloud around. Around the cloud around. See, you, you, you. You, but make it foggy. See, move it in, make it roll. So that's nice, 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 nice. See, now I will have, I will have, I come forwards. I will come forwards. All of a sudden, here is something popping up, and there is something popping up. Maybe here is a kind of a tree popping up, and then then you can make something bigger if you want. See, that's already a bit forwards more. There's another tree there. And then you can create a kind of a fir tree, a, a, a leaf tree around with the round, round head there. We let it disappear in the fog again. See, and then you don't know where you are, what is going on there. But all this fog, all this fog, I mean, here is a little bit of, see, but all the same colors, just a bit darker and with a bit more pressure. See, there you are. Right now I don't show even the tree trunks. I just make it like little silhouettes. You see there, the other one. And again, roll in the white in front of it. 
watch. Clean your brush and get it on my divide. A touch of red would be good. But just just think about red. See, then it, uh, it becomes too loud, then you're in trouble too. See, it has to be very, very, very gentle. See, here I was. See, something like that, something like that. And then again, on the bottom, a bit darker, a bit darker, a bit darker on the bottom. See there, a darker. So this it gets together, you can get that cloud, to, it's kind of, kind of a movement of like a cloud is going by there. And it's usually there are clouds, but it really is, it's just low, Low clouds, they're just floating along, and that's it. See, then you can hypnotize the whole thing, the whole, that whole painting. See, you can hypnotize that whole painting, makes it even more foggy. See, look at that. See, having not so much paint on this is just wonderful how you can get that fog, smear it in and move it in, and there you are, you see. Still in the fog, still moving. So now we come forwards, we come forwards. And now I like to think, I like to think there's a stream coming out here somewhere, water coming out somewhere. And then it gets darker. We then, yeah, sure, get darker. In front, you see everything. In front, you see everything. See? There. Let's do it. Let's just watch. Try to make it so this this dark disappears into the fog now. See? Let it just dark here. Even blue, you can put a bit more blue in here. So then you really have it the close up. You are standing here on the water already, but it gets lighter, foggier, 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 foggier. See? Can you see how wonderful we create fog? I'm glad we do it. Because you never know when you paint what kind of a mood you want to put into your painting and, and how you want to, what kind of a happy ending you want. <clears throat> so, see, that automatically you have that, it's not good enough. Okay, good, then we make it more blue in front. See, that is because you're standing there in that water. See, as darker I get it here, as more the fog is lifted up here. That's clean. And the fog is all in the back. See, watch. See? And that disappear to nothing. Nothing. Oh, that's beautiful how you come out of that. <coughs> Now the next step is, the next step is, the next step is, we will, we will, we will create another tree. Now here is just happen a bigger tree standing there and is in front of this fog. See, it's already in front of this fog. See, now we let it disappear again in fog. Can you see, this is in the back. There's the fog in between. Then comes out the tree in front, then next fog. And then you can put fog in between after. But this is what makes it so nice to come out of that fog. Can you see how wonderful dreaming along on your own painting? It's a happy day goes by. It's such a powerful day goes by. And uh, you know you created something what God gave us, this beautiful global where we live on. And I feel sometimes I talk to God, you know, and he says, boy, look at I let you live on this beautiful global and just create the best, create whatever you see. Sure, I can make a mess out of that if I want to, but if I want to, you know, 
there's a lot of common sense. And it, it makes me happy some way. See, there's the other tree. See, you, you just, uh, but let it disappear. See, watch, look. Let it disappear yonder again. See, then can you, have, you can have other tree, or other grout. You can have a little roof in between. See, watch. Let me do that. Let me do that. You just all of a sudden think, my God, there's a house. But it is a house. Is it a house? There's some kind of a movement. Maybe I use a knife. It might give me a bit more, a bit, a bit more living power. Yes, it's just happened. There's a little roof sticking out. See, and then dream it in like fog again. Just let it just go in, in like fog again and let it disappear. See, isn't it wonderful how you can do all those wonderful things? This just happened, there's a corner of a roof sticking out. And then again, you just grab your big brush and you roll the foreground. You roll your foreground. See? Watch. See how nice? All of a sudden you run that fog around there and, and then it's disappearing again. There you are. Look at that. See, now you, 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 you. Then put the darken from the bottom again. See, otherwise it wouldn't look too good. Yeah, I just put the cloud in there. And as you come more forward, as more you can, can see it. See, there you are. Always the next shift, you, you make the miles. You come from far away, the closer step, closer step, closer step, and then finally you are home. Finally here, I would already put a bit of a tree trunk in, foggy tree trunk. There, maybe other little bit of a grout standing up there. See, good, 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 good. Now in front of that, oh, let's hypnotize that. Yeah, I keep my dirty brush, hypnotize that. The brush is dry and, and it, is, it looks dirty, but it is not really. It's just, uh, I need that little bit of blue. I want to have that little bit of blue there. See, then I can get it nice. See. Good, 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 good. See, now here we come forward with the other, f other little tree or whatever you want to paint there. But otherwise, it is just fog. I wish I could be a good teacher to you, just you get the idea. See? Then as you come forward, everything is bigger. Yeah, see? Everything gets bigger and darker, see? So it means with other words, you put a bit more, more black and a bit more Prussian blue, a bit more alizarin crimson, and then you come forward, see, this, this tree is so much more in the front here, so I will put it as darker than this tree again, see? A mighty foot tree, I come forward. We call it the teacher, the almighty teacher, the almighty teacher. It's always nice to
See, and even here you can let it uh, disappear in fog, but what you can do here, you can already put it in, in the water there. See? So we will have one tree very close. See, here, let that, it's so much in the front, I reflect that into the water there. Can you see? But still I would like to let the cloud go by there. See, 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 see. That is nice, actually, how easy you can finish up a painting by just putting everything in the fog. <laughs> everything disappears in the fog. See? There you are. Wonderful, wonderful. Now we will, we will, see, break up that long line a little bit. See, break it up a little bit. Because it's not too good if it is uh, just, see, uh, have some branches in front. Here, maybe here too. Oh, yes, good, 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 good. So I will, I will, I will put some fog in front of that again. See, now here I make it clearer. See, and that fog puts right in the water too. I think that's a good lesson. That's a good lesson. See, now we come forwards, 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 forwards. Just try to get that that reflection in the way you think. And here's the other fog moving around. See there. Bit of dark in between. Bit of dark in between. Bit of dark in between, like that. See, <clears throat> and now, now we will, we will have, we will have an almighty tree standing right in front here and out of the fog. See how I mix my paint. I put already a bit green in now, but I didn't do before. Before it was all fog. Now here, this is such a big one. It's coming out of out, out the canvas even there. See. Yeah, that's it. That is it. Hey, that's a mighty tree here. See, by putting that bit of green in, can you see close up? Further, 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 up it goes into yonder. It is a teaching idea. I hope you understand what I had in my mind today. I think it's good for, for, it's good for the beginning, you know, when you start to see that. When you paint longer already, for the old timers, you know it, there's no problem. But I, I feel it is good for, for someone what really starts off. See, look at that. See, can you see, look at those, uh, those beautiful branches flying out there, how you handle the brush. See, this is, this is what I would like to show you. That is what, black and sap green here I have. See, and then you really, really can fire in like.
see we get right away the whole the whole close up there. It's all right in the front. It's all right in the front here. Maybe in order to make it a bit more uh, so we put a little bit of other grout in there. But the idea was to show you we come out from here into to that see that's the whole idea. That's the whole idea. <clears throat> now we put a tree trunk in there. Put a tree trunk in there. Put the other big tree trunk in here. See? That's a close up. I will not highlight that. I will just on the bottom, I will put a bit of yellow in in order to set it off here. See, then you know the close up, that's really close here. Now we have a good feeling of how the fog settles in, and it is just nothing. It's just going into yonder and it's disappearing in whatever, whatever, whatever. See? Fog. Fog, fog, fog. That was the day of fog. I hope you learned something from this. It is not a painting I would like to sell, but it, is, uh, it was a good lesson, isn't it? I think it was a good lesson. Oh, here a little bit. Cross down here a little bit. And there, that's what it is. See? Close up, further, 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 and even a little peak of a roof sticking out, and that is the whole painting. Enjoyed it? You learned something? Wonderful. Thank you for watching me. Bye-bye.